and what happens when a nature enthusiast faces one of life's most daunting challenges. The journey of Iola Williams offers a poignant glimpse into resilience amid adversity. Iolo, a name synonymous with wildlife broadcasting in the UK, has charmed viewers for decades. His adventures began with the tales of Snowdonia, weaving stories of the land's magic and its creatures. Now, viewers are poised for his latest endeavor, Yolo's Valleys, airing soon on BBC Two. Snow in this four-part series, Iolo invites us to explore the enchanting landscapes around Swansea Valley. The adventure begins with a quest along the upper Clydeck River to uncover the secret Dipper's Nest, stirring the wonder that nature holds in every rock and stream. As the episodes unfold, viewers will delight in Yolo's encounters with remarkable wildlife. Picture this, a black-tailed skimmer gliding over tranquil waters, water voles delighting in their habitat, and a majestic buzzard soaring through the sky. Each moment is a testament to Iolo's unwavering passion for the natural world. His warmth as a presenter has made him a beloved figure on shows like Winter Watch, Spring Watch, and Autumn Watch. Iolo's been a fixture on our screen since the 1990s, igniting a love for live life and audiences far and wide. And despite his success, the past year has been challenging. Iolo faced a significant health scare that changed his life. Mid-run, he collapsed, experiencing a heart attack that forced him to step back from his role. Yet resilience is woven through his story, uh, transitioning from a species officer at the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds to a media presence. Iolo has authored five books and produced a rich legacy of wildlife programming. His journey reflects determination and an undying spirit. And now, let's pause briefly. If you're enjoying this story, consider subscribing to our channel and giving that like button a, a nudge. Uh, behind the camera, Iolo is a devoted family man. Uh, he shares his life with Siri, his wife, and their two children, Dewi and Tomos, uh, with their playful rescue dogs and Yantu and Gwen. They tend to their sanctuary in Paulus, proof that their love for nature extends beyond the screen. Yet with the health scare fresh in his mind, Iolo grappled with the ramifications of his heart attack. An unexpected turn led him into surgery to insert a stent, allowing him to continue his work with renewed purpose. Life's hurdles aren't the end, he reflects, buoyed by the support of his family, friends, and the NHS. His connection to nature serves not only as a lifeline, but a reminder of the beauty that surrounds and sustains us. As we close, remember that nature has its own rhythm. Here's a light-hearted note. Why did the Scarecrow win an award? Because he was outstanding in his field. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time, higher serious leviation.